In a shocking turn of events, Rock posted this to her Instagram claiming she's moving back into Blueface's house. I'm going to lie because they got me f***ed up. Okay, what you do? I, I got back with my baby daddy. That way. You only back with me too. And Carlissa didn't waste any time and quickly posted a story on her Instagram saying that the house is already falling apart. What up, one man, one vision? Rock back in the house. Girl, I seen it, honey. I seen it with my own eyes. We just gotta pray for him. We gotta pray, honey. He didn't get to see that last live. He don't know what's going on, honey. Now the internet is patiently waiting for Jaden and Blueface to say something about all of this drama. It's safe to say that Blueface has been forcing his way into being the center of attention on social media for many months now. Some fans may even go on to say that he's put his music career behind him and has taken a completely different approach with his fame. Because of this, when someone mentions Blueface, you can't help but immediately think of his baby mama Chris Sean Rock as well. The two have built a successful career that revolves around drama and chaos, which is then translated into going viral on the internet. Due to their constant stunts, it's pretty hard to differentiate between what is actually true and what is scripted, especially now that Rock has publicly announced that she is moving back into Blueface's house after everything that's happened between them. Not only did she say she was moving in with him, but she also said that she's planning on getting back together with him and having another baby. The crazy part is that all of this is going down while Blueface is still in prison. I got me up, Why y'all acting like that? Like, uh, I'm Mariah B. On the, I see you on the phone with her thugger. That's how I'm on the phone with Blue. Hey, Daddy, I miss you. That bad as shit. <laughs> To everything we have to take it a couple weeks back to when Blue's mom posted a story on Instagram hinting that he was in prison. Her post read, My baby is in jail, and my heart is broken again because they don't listen. Jaden got him one charge, and Rock got him the one that violated the other. That's why it's so quiet. Praying everyone now understands why I didn't want them together. Because parents want the best for their children. I love them all, but not together. Praying for everyone to listen to their parents. Not long after she posted that, Rock went on Instagram Live where she appeared to be in a courthouse. In the live, you could also hear WAC100 talking, which pretty much confirmed that they were there for Blueface. That same day, Blueface took advantage of the situation and dropped an album titled Free Blueface. It was later revealed that he did indeed turn himself in with no release date or bail set. Fans began to assume that this was due to probation violations. I told you I was coming here. Whack. Whack. <laughs> 
Oh, yeah. That way. He's taking care of business. What if handling some, um, some mandatory issues, man? Jaden Alexis then tweeted at Carlissa saying, For the love of God, shut the F up. Carlissa then posted a screenshot of the tweet on her story and captioned it, Imagine spending your 27th birthday behind bars for a BM that got a girlfriend, kissing in front of your kids, hollering to your mama to shut up for the love of God. Oh, okay, this is an oxymoron. At this point, nobody knows why Blueface is behind bars, and the only people who do know are coming at each other's throats on social media. Fans are assuming either Rock or Jaden are the reason why Blueface is in jail, and rumors are flying everywhere. Blueface's original charge for assault was on November 4th, 2021, while he was out with Jaden and he was put on probation on November 18th, 2022. And while being out with Rock, the Las Vegas phone incident occurred on May 29th, 2023, but this charge was then later dismissed. However, on May 26th, 2023, a warrant was issued for a possible probation violation, which then led to his July 6th warrant hearing. And on August 11th, the violation hearing began, but it was put off until January 12th. So while fans are accusing both Rock and Jaden for being the reason Blueface is in jail, others are pointing out that he already had some legal trouble that was most likely the cause for him getting locked up. It was later revealed that his release date was set for July 2nd, 2024. However, it is more than likely that he won't be required to do the full time. At this point, everyone is wondering whether or not Jaden's music career will survive since she no longer has Blueface next to her giving her clout. Meanwhile, Rock posted a tweet and went on live where she explained how she was a bit overwhelmed due to the support she receives from her fans when she's out and about running errands. She was teary-eyed during her live stream when she thanked everyone for their support during her challenging week. Rock also announced on live that she will not be going back to baddies due to not being offered enough money. No, I already made it clear I'm not going to baddies. If you want to pay the fee for me to pull up, that's cool. The founder and CEO of the Zeus Network then indirectly responded to Rock's announcement relating to her leaving the show by saying, affording to pay certain individuals is not a Zeus issue. We make smart investments, not emotional, impulsive, or erratic ones. Natalie Nunn also had something to say about the whole Rock ordeal and posted to her Instagram with a post that read, I've been really busy getting ready to host my first award show today. I have caught up on all the BS about the Zeus network that's been being said by an individual that I truly can't believe is making any of these comments. All I'm gonna say is I'm in shock after everything Lemuel Plummer has done. Wow, unbelievable. He literally has done the most unthinkable for talent at Zeus. I personally will say Lemmy has changed my life and my family's life. No network has ever given me endless opportunities and paid me like this ever. People need to crawl before they walk and understand that. After a few days of Blueface being locked up, Rock went back on IG Live to say that she spoke to Blue and he asked her to be his girlfriend. How do you even know what's going on in the vlogs? To oh, you was getting ready to ask me to be your girlfriend. What are you talking about, bro? Why do motherfuckers think they could put out one thing and receive another? Like at the same time, Jaden Alexis released a phone call with Blueface from behind bars, where Blue claimed to love being in there. Hey, I love it here. Active, it's cranky. It's the only place you can go over and you might go to jail for. It. Cause I'm already in jail for it. This is where Soldier Boy enters again because he went on live to flex the 1.5 million he made the same day that Blueface got locked up. Yes, sir. Now you're sitting in jail, broke as fuck. I gotta go put in your baby mama's for Valentine's while you in jail. It hit different when you in jail. Soldier, chill. How do you go to jail? I get 1.5 million the same day, and you a snitch too. <laughs> I'm finna send a booty bag. He even posted a screenshot showing the transactions from Warner Bros, quoting it, you do the math. He also said he's putting $1,000 on his books so he could buy himself some hot Cheetos. I got $1,000 on nigga books, man. Some pack of soups, some good hot flame hot Cheetos, man. Who, who locked up in that with blue butt? He did circle back not long after and apologize for going too far. He claimed he wanted to be the bigger person because he's too busy getting money to be worried about him. I wasn't feeling that live, bro. I should never let no be able to stoop me down to that level, bro. So why I'm laughing at a because he in jail. It was funny for a little five minutes. I feel like I let the, the inner get to me, dude. Soldier boy sh you know what I'm saying? So I'm just like, man, fuck this. I'm finna turn up, I'm finna flash out. You know what I'm saying? But me as a real I'm just like, man, you know what? I gotta be real. It ain't about what nobody think. It ain't about the internet. It's about me as, as a man and as a person. You did what I'm saying? And as a man, as a person for me, man, I'm just gonna squash the whole thing, man. I'm over this shit. It started off as some, it started off as some, Funny Marco and then it went to some verses. Who, who got more hits? Then it went just left hand. You feel what I'm saying? It went left hand, which I jumped out the window too, like talking about a girl, like, oh, I, I, I F your girl and I do this and do that. Well, I shouldn't have said that. You know what I'm saying? 
I should've just, you know, be like, man, you know what? I got more hits than Blueface, the end. But, you know, ah, ha, he, he think he could beat me in the verses. Ha, 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 for sure. And kept it moving. And nothing good gonna come from beefing, but death, death or jail. I know what it feel like to be locked down in the jail, sick. You know what I'm saying? You don't know what, you don't know what's gonna happen. You don't know what's going on on the outside. Cause I ain't fuck with you. Ain't nobody putting money on your books. And I know what it feel like, and you know what I'm saying? They said put money. On. I got a thousand dollars. Whoever, 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 whoever know, whoever know, somebody, uh, blue face people, whack one hundred. Somebody, y'all hit me up. I'm put a thousand dollars on that nigga books. Put a thousand dollars on that nigga books. Free blue face. You feel what I'm saying? We don't wear jail on no Let that nigga come out and do his You know what I'm saying? And that's the end of that That's the end of that. You know what I'm saying? I love all my fans. I'm sorry y'all had to see me doing all that on the internet, man. I just be getting caught up sometimes with this the beef between Soldier Boy and Blueface all started off as some friendly competition when Blueface was a guest on Funny Marco's show Open Thoughts. Throughout the show, Funny Marco interviewed Blueface where he then asked him who he thinks would win in a versus battle, himself or Soldier Boy. Blueface then said he could outperform anyone and followed up by saying that he F's with Soldier Boy. All right, hit for hit, you and Soldier Boy, who you think gonna win? Nationwide. Hit for hit, you and Soldier Boy, you'll win. Better choose the right side. Who will win? And what? Hit for hit, song for song. You and Soldier Boy. You and Soldier? Hit for hit. Versus. <sighs> if I were to be honest, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a professional performer. So I can, I can be So anybody. you could outperform Soldier Boy? I can outperform anybody to hit for hit. Soldier Boy? Soldier? Bro. You can Why are you saying Soldier Boy? Okay. Shout out to f Soldier. I f with Soldier. Mm -hmm. This is where things went sideways, however, because Soldier Boy couldn't hold his tongue after finding out that Blueface said that he believes he could outperform him. Soldier Boy went on Instagram and said, Inside a ride in that You go perform Bust Down Tatiana five times in a row. Cut it out. That ain't including She Make It Clap, Ricky Borty. I got songs with 50 Cent, all type of shit. Like, bro, do you really know my catalog? Come on, bruh. Gucci bandana with Gucci man and Shawty Low. Rest in peace, Shawty Low. Don't make me go in the in the in the vault. I get to pulling out shit with Bow Wow and shit. What? I get to pulling out shit with Yo Gotti. Get to pulling out shit with Game. You know how many songs I got, buddy? I get to pulling out shit with Snoop Dogg. I got I got songs with Snoop Dogg, Fifty Cent, Bow Wow. Who else, who, name them, Trey Songz, Omarion, everybody, DJ Khaled, what? After that, Blueface went and did what he does best by going on a Twitter rant and calling out Soldier Boy. He first tweeted saying, I hit your BM already, Soldier Boy. Ask her who performs better hit for hit. He followed this tweet up with, when I heard the word Jaden come out his mouth, now that's where he f***ed up, and that one's gonna cost you every time. I turned to a savage about Jaden. Blueface was referring to this part of the video of Soldier Boy calling him out about the versus situation. Your mouth, n***a. And Jaden mouth, Lame ass n Watch your mouth when you speak it on me, What? Before I go- Because after this, Blueface and Soldier Boy went on a two-day rant where they were throwing shots at each other about everything. Blueface continued his tweets with, Hello, mother If you don't take it far, it won't go further. This was the same thing he had recently told Rock during their own Twitter beef. Blue continued his tweets by saying, I'm so glad my BM ain't going like that. You see how fast that man shut up. Fastest way to a heart is through his baby mama's pussy. Pick your baby mama wisely, that sh is a weakness for real. I got one BM and I ain't having kids with nobody else. If she don't want to have any more kids, I'ma get a vasectomy. After saying all of that, Soldier Boy didn't take the bait and ignored him at first by not responding to him on Twitter, but the internet was going off over the drama and the two rappers were trending over the versus beef. This is when and Blue went ahead and said, that versus conversation is over. We know who won, cause quiet as a b His baby mama told him that he ain't f with me, hit for hit, followed by a eggplant emoji. He continued the rant with a series of tweets where he said, this is his baby mama right here. Shouldn't have brought up Jaden. Play this at the verses and it's over. Now I'm a bully cuz. Don't ever let Jaden come out your mouth. He posted another tweet saying, I'm a sore winner and finished off by saying, welcome to the circus soldier. I'm gonna use you for an extra day to go viral. This is when soldier boy finally stepped out and replied to him by tweeting, hey blood, you sound like a 
Who give a f about a hoe? I'm slapping the fuck out you when I see you. You let a white boy and Trippy Red's homeboy take you. Now you out here crashing out. We gonna see who get the last laugh. Go get you back. I'm gonna f Jaden and Rock since you want a troll. Let the games begin. Blueface then responded to him and said, Let's see. I don't know what you're talking about. Rock for one ain't my baby mama. That's scientifically proven. Your BM been f Get back lame. He then tweeted a video that he captioned, I got your BM on all fours. Soldier Boy then responded to Blueface and said, Boy you hype because you met a before me. You act like this was recent. Tender I'm beating you up when I see you. Drop that pin. Blueface then tweeted, Soldier Boy couldn't f Jaden in the dark even if she thought it was me. Soldier then said, You lonely and depressed right now and it's okay I'm here to keep you company and beat your Blueface kept taunting Soldier Boy and even tweeted, Soldier kissing every time he see his child might even be my kid. He ain't even get the DNA test. To which Soldier replied with, The way you're fantasizing and reminiscing over a bitch I f is crazy. You're never gonna get your bitches back acting like this, blue butt. Boy claim your child, you know that's your son. And they both getting fucked? It's stamped. You that mad trippy lil homie piping your chick down? He finished off by tagging Jade and Alexis and said, where you at? Followed by the eyes emoji. Blueface continued by going back to taking shots at Soldier Boy's baby mama and posting a picture that he captioned, all on cuz breath. He then posted a video that was on Soldier Boy's Instagram where he's seen rapping along to one of Blueface's songs and captioned it, fan since 2018, this man been a fan acting like he only knows Thadiana. Things only escalated from here because the two hopped on Instagram live with each other where they talk smack. They even agreed on a place to meet up and throw hands. Blueface ended up going to said location and posted the videos on Instagram and started tweeting at him for not showing up. Blueface said, We all knew he wouldn't show. He better not say nothing else after today. Soldier Boy then quote, tweeted Blueface's tweet and responded with, I'm slapping the sh** out of you and punching on you on my terms. Bitch, who said you run sh** and get to pick the time and place? Don't worry, it's on the way. Now stop tweeting about me before I pop out tonight. And we slid through, you wasn't there. Probably had 12 waiting on us. After that, Soldier Boy subtweeted Blueface and said, Blue Butt wanna play police games, say less. Blueface then pointed out that Soldier Boy had said, we and us, alluding that he had shown up to fight him with other people. He tweeted saying, we and us should tell you everything you need to know about Soldier. Like I said, he never came. What type of says, send the pin, you send the pin. Now it's not on my terms in place. This man backpedaling so bad, I thought you slid through and I was wasn't there. Soldier Boy is a mark scared to pull up to a kid's park in the suburbs. He finished off by saying, let me know your terms and conditions little bro. I show you how it's supposed to go. I'll pull up wherever you feel safe at. Let me know please. Less talking, more action. Let's get this out the way. I already f***ed his BM so if he don't want to even the score, I'll just take the dub I guess. I'm not like these other soldier been into it with. I'm still up looking for cuz. Start talking crazy. I don't want to hear none of that. You took Hold it. on. You no, no, no. It. I don't want to hear none of that. Nah, that's cool. All of that's cool. I just don't like how you playing the narrative that I'm taking it further than music. That's what you did. How? I said, shout out to Soldier in the interview. You know what you did? You got on live. I'm going to stick in her. I'm going to stick in her. Here you go. Here we go. That's Where did that so, come about? That's what you want. So, 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 so that, so that hurt your feelings that bad? Nah, it didn't hurt my feelings. They just let me know what it is really on and I already f your baby mama so the fact that you took it there oh yeah I already beat you I already beat you to the punch I already beat you to the punch all right so check it out I already right? beat you right, to the punch check it out check it out right go ahead so, you want to hop on here and pop it right yeah why did you talk about old sh bud? what's old about your bm suck what did you what is why did you talk about sh before she even met sh your baby mama the day before your baby shower why is you on here? So you on here popping it like that? So, so, Why so, so, hey, so, 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 check this out. Check this out. So, check this out, right? What, what you want, my nigga? You want a cookie? You want a no. cookie? Oh. You want a cookie? You Let's give Blueface a cookie and a you Happy Meal and a Soldier yeah. Toys. Blood. Yeah. So what, blood? Hey, there you go. Admit that. Now I'm saying, Admit so you fuck. So, so you Admit fuck that. After Soldier Boy's recent diss, Blueface released a phone call where he says that he doesn't need Soldier Boy's thousand dollar offer and that he's looking forward to the fade. Right, I heard Soldier Boy apologize, man. That shit was real, real respectful. That's more like it. With a thousand dollars in my pocket, you can keep that small change. But I still need that fade on that's why he promised me that right According to TMZ, Blueface was put under administrative segregation where he won't be able to leave his cell for more than seven hours a week for education classes and religious services. He still, however, has access to his shared TV unit in the library. And while Blueface is stuck in prison, Rock has been out and about doing her thing. She was even a part of a show that got crashed by some goons that stole equipment, pulled out their tools, and attacked people. 
Fans have even recently questioned Rock about being pregnant to which she denied and followed by saying that she will be as soon as Blueface is out. She's apparently excited to start her relationship with Blueface back up, which infuriated fans. She even went on Instagram Live to defend her love for him claiming that he apologized to her and that they've been working on things since before he went to jail. Y'all uh. mad that I forgave him. Okay, he forgave me too. He already apologized. Like, You know why? Because we both want the same thing. Remember every time I kept saying, me and Blue don't get along because we don't want the same thing. We want the same thing. <coughs> Before he even went to jail, bro. She then later went live again to let everyone know that even though she owns her own home, she's been staying at Blueface's lately. Not just that, but she even filmed herself recording a song inside his studio. Carlissa then reacted to her staying at his house by posting a comment saying, Blueface daddy is the only one with permission to be at his house per his HOA, but carry on.